All right, continuing on with chapter 14, let's go, sorry, chapter 18, let's go on to page 509. So on page 509, you have these definitions, the definition of carbon capture, carbon sequestration, carbon storage, and cap and trade. So carbon capture is a way to actually capture the carbon produced by, let's say, a coal burning power plant. And sometimes uh, some of the talk is to pump it underground. And um, carbon sequestration is where planting forests and things to try to uh, remove the carbon in the atmosphere. Carbon storage is also um, storing the carbon underground. And then cap and trade, we went over previously in another um, chapter, chapter, um, I think it's either six or seven, we talked about cap and trade. Um, so make sure you know that. Down here we have the wedge game, which is uh, a way to reduce greenhouse gas emissions in different ways. So the theory is that we can't just pick one way, like it's all the cars, let's all drive electric cars, or it's all burning coal, let's not burn coal. So there are a lot of things that we can do to um, prevent more greenhouse gases and to lower greenhouse gases. And so the wedge means there is this amount that we could delay greenhouse gases by doing these things. And what should we do? And so there's a lot of talk on these are our ideas on how to reduce and stabilize the climate. Um, and which ones do we want to pick and go for? And so this um, caption here explains the wedge game really well. So make sure you know this as well. On page 510, we have the Kyoto Protocol, which was 1997. This was the first time that nations came together and said, we need to fix climate change. It was similar to the Montreal Protocol, which fixed uh, the ozone layer. But the problem is that um, the United States did not sign the Kyoto Protocol because they said it was unfair that developing nations such as um, China and India did not have to reduce their greenhouse gas emissions because they were building their economies. And um, the counter argument is that the United States emits um, a fifth of all the world's greenhouse gases. So we're the prime emitters, but yet we don't want to reduce. And so um, you can read some of the ins and outs of that as well. All right, going on to page. Uh, page 513, so some of, oh, up here, I'm going to put a little sticky note on here in a minute to know this cap and trade um, diagram here. It explains the cap and trade methods. Make sure you know and can be able to describe cap and trade. And then down here, know what a carbon tax is. So these are ideas. They are not currently going on. Um, but they are ideas of ways to reduce our carbon emissions. And so taxes on things that reduce, that emit carbon. And um, fee and dividend, I think I spelled dividend wrong, that's a D, I'll fix it. Carbon neutrality, know the definition of that, and carbon offsets. So those are, again, all ways that we um, can help fix uh, climate change and global warming. And then on this page, 514, um, know the definition of geoengineering and carbon footprint. So those are two um, so geoengineering is another approach to try and suck the carbon dioxide out of the air. And then carbon footprint is like our eco footprint, but it's just for carbon. All right, that's the end of chapter 18.